League SPC method is one of the most popular methods of all time on FIFA. In this video, I'm going to show you a five-step plan on how to do League SPC method. Step one is spamming bronze pack. As you can see, we have a 750 coin bronze pack that has been opened. Now, we've actually been very, very lucky because one, play the clip, we've got a perfect link uh, in bronze packs. And also, we've been able to pack four League SPC players. Now, if you're starting this method off and you don't have many coins, the first thing you need to do is spam bronze packs. And what you need to do sell everything that is major league now the major leagues are premier league syria la liga league One, and uh, the german bundesliga so the five main leagues sell absolutely everything this will allow you to keep making coins whilst opening these bronze packs for any mine leagues that you pack so minor leagues are not the five main leagues for example this guy is from the belgian league now you could sell him and make some coins however for the purpose of this method you're already selling every main league so you're getting your coins from there you keep every single card from a minor league. At the end of this video, I'll show you every bronze card we sell during the video. Now, this is an example of another bronze pack. You will get a lot of these. So you might get someone like this, and uh, N Metro, who actually, I think, got an SBC recently. And he currently is one of the major leagues, so you sell this card. However, cards like this that are from non-league SBCs, right? That are leagues that do not have a league SBC. So, for example, the English third league, League One, who does not have a league SBC, Leak is currently selling for 200 coins well he's not selling for 200 coins what you need to do is you need to keep every single one of these cards that do not sell from an off league now sometimes you might have a card that is from a non-league SBC. however there is still potential to sell for example this card right here now he may not sell straight away but he is a rare card and in the icon SBC section every icon you complete requires 11 rare bronze cards and this is why sometimes you get cards that do sell and they're not from a league SBC. Make sure you always sell all of those cards and be patient. Step number two. Now you have loads of bronze cards that you've been stacking that are non-league SBC cards. And you come over to this section right here, which is the bronze upgrade. Whilst doing a bronze upgrade, you want to get rid of every league that you have in your club. Absolutely empty your club from these non-league SBCs. So for example, Premier League and Championship have a league SBC. Ignore those leagues. League 3 and League 4 don't have a, a, a league SBC. So we're going to go there. So League 1, we're going straight here. And as you can see, we've got loads of bronzes. If I change the bronze, we oh, I say loads of bronzes. We've got a few bronzes that we can use. And that is literally all you need to do. So now you've run out of League 3 players. No problem. You move on to League 4. And there you go. We've got loads of League 4 players. Now, again, some of these cards might actually have a value. Some of these rare cards that I'm putting in could have a value. If you're struggling for coins, I would definitely sell them. If you're not really struggling for coins, then it doesn't really matter. I mean, again, some of these cards might have a 200 coin value here and there. But just for the purpose of the video, I'm going to go straight into it. Now, you need 40 chemistry uh, to obviously do. So we're going to shift that around. There's your 40 chemistry. Empty your club as much as possible. Don't spend any coins buying bronze cards. Just empty out as much as you can from non-league SBCs. And you're going to have a load and loads of bronze upgrades that are going to give you silver cards. So we have three silver packs, which are going to give you six silver cards in total. Now, step three. Every single silver card that is from a League SBC, they are all untradeable. So you have to keep those cards. Every card that is a non-League SBC, I'll tell you what to do. So as you can see, our first pack, we have got a French non-League SBC card. I will keep that to put into another SBC in a second. And with this card right here, he's a Mexican League player and he does have a League SBC. So he will come in handy when we complete the Mexican League SBC. Now, step three still involves this exact same process as you were doing for step two. But now it's with silver cards. So you go into your silver upgrade. Again, you have to make sure you choose non-League SBC League. So right now, if we go to, again, we can go to League 3. And we've got loads of silver cards from League 3 that are never going to be used in my club. You can check if some of them have value. Maybe if you have a couple of tradable cards. No problem, but make sure you absolutely empty your club the exact same the way you did for the bronze cards. And that way, you'll get loads of gold common cards. Moving on to step four. Now, you'll have loads of these three common gold players packs. Now, they only have common players from the title and three players involved. So what we're going to do is we're going to open these up and I'll tell you how to delegate them each. So we actually managed to get an inform. Uh, you can get cards. I mean, that is sensational. An 83 rated inform from a common gold pack. If any card has a special card in the game at the moment and has a common card, you can, as you can see, pack them from these. That is, I mean, that is spectacular. That is an extra 10,000 coins. And Rui is a club legend. We love to see it. So there we go. So that's an extra 10,000 coins there that I didn't expect. However, as you can see, you'll get loads of League SBC cards from this. And that's this is when your League SBCs will start to complete themselves. 
because you'll get loads of gold cards that will easily fill out the best two sections in, in the main major leagues. Now, step four involves these three upgrades that we have. The first two, they are only available for three days. However, the last one, the gold upgrade, is available every so often. It comes out for a long period of time. At the moment, it's out for another month almost. So what you do is you have now have loads of gold common cards, right, in your club. And this is where you can get a little bit creative. You can actually choose to use certain league SBCs that you might not want to complete right now and get some more upgrades. That way you can pack yourself some fodder to do mid icon packs or other icon packs, etc. You can pack yourself some fodder to obviously do some of these player SBCs if you want to. Or you can go straight over to this one right here and just get gold rare cards that you can put into different league SBCs. So what we're going to do is we're going to complete one of each and see what we get. Step five, enjoy your pack and make sure you rinse and repeat. So we have a player pick. Now these have been very, very overpowered. Can we get something special? Can we get a little bit of fodder? We actually get Slabhead, Harry Maguire, 84 rated, all crafted for absolutely nothing. Eh, some League SBC business. We now have a two rare gold players pack. Now, I actually packed a first owner, Cristiano Ronaldo, from one of these when he was around 800 to 900k. I was actually live on stream as well. So in this pack, we get a Brazilian left back. It's going to be Marcelo. Now, he is obviously a League SBC card. Very, very common as well, to be fair. As you can see, he's a duplicate. Now, a card like this right here, you can use these in your player picks. Cards that do not have a League SBC, but is a rare card. Very, very helpful to craft more player picks for you. Now, this pack right here is actually very, very underrated. 81 to 87 may seem very dead at the start. However, this, you can actually pack Renato Sanchez, Kim Pembe, etc. from this pack. You can pack Quadrado, I'm pretty sure, from here as well. There are a lot of road to the finals that are actually 81 to 87 rated, but because now they've got a massive boost, you can pack one of the big boys. So let's see, can we get a road to the final in an 81 to 87? It only requires four cards as well. We actually get a walkout, which is sensational right here. That is 86 rated Sergio Biscuits. You love to see it, man. These 81 to 87 packs may be the play right now, even over player picks. Hey, I'm happy with that. If you made it to the end of this video, here we are, the transfer list. Now, these are all the things that we've sold during this video and during our recording. Now, we've opened a few bronze packs and sold everything that sells. Now, this card right here, look, he's an Irish player, right? He'd probably quick sell for like 15 coins. But I thought, you know what? I'll try and list him up for 200 because I saw that he was going for a maybe 200 coins and we got very lucky with him and he did sell so make sure you check every single player's price before you put it into your club or discard it if it's a duplicate in yesterday's video i did do a giveaway for everyone so if you guys want to get involved i'm still waiting for everyone to obviously get involved and i'll draw the winner in the next few days by drawing a random comment i'll put the video right there so make sure you go watch it and in the video obviously it's icon swaps which will tell you the best possible combinations that you need for icon swaps right now